Hey Care Bears, it's Haley here. Welcome back to another Lana Lore video. In today's video, the big door has finally open. People have been waiting on this forever. As you know, all uh, eight of these doors were supposed to open before the big one. And now you can see the big door at the end of the hall. And there was a questionnaire that happened. This is the new area where questionnaires happen. It has like the Lana chair in the middle and everything just like the questionnaire game used to have or it still has, but Lana hasn't been there in a while because she died there. So they have a new and improved questionnaire stage in here now and there's like flowers all around. Lana did once say that she liked flowers, I'm pretty sure. She liked red flowers and then you can see the only gravestone here is Lana's, which is weird because in the questionnaire game, it has like a lot of different gravestones, I'm pretty sure. As you can see right here in the questionnaire game, there is uh, gravestones for all the missing people, but Sadie's is underneath the house. But then over here is four gravestones, which was for the coterie members that died, but also Lana that died here. And the coterie members that died were Sonny, Raphael, and Michael that died because like they were being executed. And now that we're talking about executions, Nellie and Nathan are possibly going to be executed as well. They found Nathan, which is what we found out in my video I posted yesterday, is that they have Nathan in their captivity. So Nellie was already confirmed to be locked up somewhere within this area, but it was behind this bookshelf over here in this room. And there was a note on it that said that Nathan still needs to be found. So they have found him. And now let's just go ahead and go back into the big door now. And basically all throughout the map, there is just pictures of Lana kind of like insinuating like doppelgangers are going to be made of her. But then there's also this poster and it's kind of weird. It's like the man that Lana has seen in her dreams, which we have found out or at least it was alluded to it being uh agamemnon but it says every night all over the world hundreds of people see this face in their dreams if this man appears in your dreams too or if you have any information that can help us identify him please contact us so did lana make all these posters and put them everywhere i don't know it's really weird like i don't know if like agamemnon's aware of all these posters all over the place but this is just lana's chair i i think it looks really cool and they also have her grave like i said but there's this other room in here called the chamber so let's go ahead and go in here and you can see it says live execution so this is probably going to be where nathan and nelly are executed and it's kind of confirmed here with this note it's kind of hard to read um it basically says nelly nathan horizon so it looks like it's listing off all of the people that are going to be sacrificed um eventually and the sacrifice or the execution is sometime this week it's what moto princess said so they're gonna like send out a private server link in the gilded server to let everybody join for the execution which is also kind of scary like i don't know what day but it's just sometime this week which by the way if you end up making it to the execution please record it and send it to my email call me Haley fanarts at gmail.com because i might not be able to join and i would just very much appreciate it so that it can be in my next video on the lana lore but i'm really busy this week so i don't know when it's gonna happen please do record it if you can or at least take screenshots if you don't know how to record or just screen record on your phone or something because i really hope that i don't miss this i feel like it's going to be a huge deal we don't know for sure if they're gonna die or not like they might just try to like kill lana again because they did it before i'm sure they can do it again but with agamemnon around i don't know if that will actually be the case so it might actually end up being a lot messier than we think this time and i'm kind of excited i also am kind of worried i won't be able to make it so make sure to email me any information you find out but anyways they did have a questionnaire here like i said so i have some screenshots from kpop lover on the lana's ogos discord server so thank you so much again for sending all these pictures for everybody to use and lana was with agamemnon and they answered a few questions 
I am sure, you all have countless questions to where I have been and what I have been doing while I was dead. We are here to answer your questions. Nathan and Ellie are in our captivity. We have them in a room secluded behind a bookshelf. I think it is inaccessible for you all. Unfortunately, Nellie did do something to us. However, that question has been answered before. Yes, I do trust Agamemnon. He was the one who transferred my soul to a new body after I died. I believe in giving others second chances. Lana with her potential. Def Mullen deserve one. And no, she is not another one of my experiments. Behind me is the chamber which will be used for the executions of Nelly and Nathan. If that is your question, I do not know what happened to the Debs. They are just fine. I just have them in isolation for now. I assure you, they are all alive. The patrons are safe. So are the Horizon. We promise to protect you all. I am sorry, but we must depart back to our dorms. Before I go, I promise to open more doors for you soon, and the execution will be planned sometime this week. Before I go, please drop your user only ranking people Horizon. And that is all for ranking. Please check your role in the group to see if you got in. I'm sorry if you did not get in. There will be more opportunities later. Goodbye. So that was all that was really said in the questionnaire. So like Agamemnon was talking about where they're found behind a bookshelf. He was lying a lot in his like messages that he was sending out to everybody. But he said that Nellie and Nathan are like trapped behind a bookshelf. But he doesn't think that we can get in. But like we literally can. All, all the way over here. If we just type in Clag with me. We can get in. So he lied about that right here. We can go through. And here is the door. And let's see. Did the notes change? No. They did not change yet still. But also another thing is he said that Lana isn't like his like test subject I guess like it's not an experiment for him but he kind of has confirmed that it is too so he just keeps lying and lying I can't remember which room it is I think oh yes it's this one if you go down here you can literally go to his like testing room and here we are we are in the testing room right here and he even like talks about the experiments here like we've we've read through all of this but it even says i experimented again this one is disturbing like he is really trying to make doppelgangers of lana and it seems like she might not be aware of it she might think that she's just going to get cured but really he's using her to make more of her basically so I do think that he was lying within like every response, but he usually is. But Lana seems to be a little bit more truthful now. So I feel like she is still just being manipulated, saying she trusts him when she shouldn't. And she even isn't even sure who the man that she sees in her, her dreams is because she's putting these posters all around the map saying like, have you seen this man? Like, I wonder what Agamemnon thinks when he sees these because he knows deep down that this is him. Like, come on. So, I and also, it's confirmed that this is him, if you didn't know, because in another room, it talks about that. I think it's in like the theater room. I can't remember which room that is. I think this is the theater room right here. If we go in here, there is two things that he lied about that are proved to be the other way around in here. So, first of all, Agamemnon's talking about how his true form will be victorious. I just need more parts to fulfill me. And then it even says here, I appear in her dreams looking to scare her onto our side. Everything works out in the end. Just confirm that. And then if we go behind here, there's a door right here. And there is this room. And this is the devs right here. And they're all dead. So, he said that they're just in isolation. No, they're all dead. But there is one person, as you can see right there, Diarbin, who's still question marks. So, we still don't know anything about that. We don't know why they're just question marks. So, we might find that out very soon. But it even says here, a morbid sight as it may be. Remember, it all is for the best. So, and they also said, I need to create the perfect doppelganger. Lana will help me. Then when all is done, I will get rid of her. So, he is not to be trusted, but Lana is trusting him. And here, they're even talking about taking the dev's eyes and how they're going to be for great advantage soon. He even confirms it by saying, I have killed everyone that wronged her in the past. So it's definitely all lies that he is spewing out around Lana. But I wonder what it would be like if he joined the game alone. What would he say then? Because 
Lana wouldn't be around, so I wonder if he would still lie to us or not, because, I don't know, like, all these notes are spread around, and it looks like it's meant for us to find out, but he also has lied and said, like, oh, there's nothing behind the bookshelf, so maybe he's just, he's just a gaslighter, really, that's all he is, is a gaslighter. One thing I noticed while I was editing this video was that there's, like, a creepy, like, shadow standing within, like, the windows in the big area. I think it's called the plaza, by the way, like, this big area. So, I don't know which window it was. Let me see. Oh, there it is. Okay, so right there in that window, it's, like, just, like, a shape of, like, somebody, like, up there looking over the whole place. And it's not in any other window. So, I just thought maybe I'd mention that because it's kind of creepy also alethia's avatar changed so now everybody in the herd has a different outfit now and this is what alethia looks like and they changed their about it says the horizon our plans for them may seem sinister and cruel but it will be crucial for the development of the awakening if you didn't know and i also showed it just like a little bit ago but in the uh chamber room it has like the note that says nathan nelly and then horizon meaning that the horizon might also be executed in the chamber so if you're a horizon um good luck i'm really scared for the execution i don't know how that's gonna go but i'm sure it's going to be very interesting and i'm kind of hoping that nathan and ellie fight her again like please like i would love to see that again <laughs> um or maybe something different like what if like nathan and ellie are like somehow on agamemnon's side or something i have no idea that would be crazy though that's all for today's video thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed make sure to leave a like and subscribe for daily roblox videos and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye care bears